Well, at 30U, it's going to be a quick one. Opportunity cost and producing dots in terms of starburst. We need to know there's a formula for this, usually called the marginal opportunity cost. And the formula is give up over gain. Over gain. Make that a little bit like that. Okay, so it's a very helpful formula when figuring out comparative advantage. Anything like that. So we're, what we're going to do is we're going to say to ourselves, okay, we're producing dots, which is this. The sugar part is just a resource. So you can actually ignore that for now. So it's just the production choices of using all the sugar for dots versus all the sugar for sugar, or all the sugar for Starburst. Starburst, not Starbucks. Um, so if I produce dots, uh, what am I giving up? I'm giving up 30 Starburst to gain 20 dots, okay? And so then just make that more simplified. It's three over two, it's 1.5 starburst, okay? So the answer to this is uh, we give up one and a half starburst for every dots that we produce. Now, just in case you were doing this, ask the other way, um, then it would be up here. It's not the answer to this particular question, but. Uh, and then we just go the other direction. So if I'm saying uh, opportunity cost producing star, bus, star burst in relation to dots, it's going to be, um, what do I give up? I give up 20 dots to gain 30 star burst. And so then it would be two thirds uh, dots. So I give up two thirds of a dot for every starburst that I produce, and that's how to calculate marginal opportunity cost.